sounds nice. Mm -hmm. It's big. Yeah, it's big. <laughs> this one maybe. Is. You want to try is that? that yeah. Why not? It looks beautiful on camera too. So let's do that. Thank you for coming. Thank you for being here. Inviting me. I want you to share your beauty routine. Mm -hmm. How to get ready. Like, what makeup do you bring? Do you have any preference for your makeup? This is like, I love this thing. And yeah, it's Maybelline baby skin. So I like it to put where I need the pores to be as minimal as possible. <laughs> I like the way it makes my skin so soft. Ugh. Yeah, it feels very, very velvety. Also put it under my eyes, eyes because then I feel like it creases less. I would take uh, Maybelline Fit Me concealer. My favorite. Yeah, it's your favorite? Yeah. So yeah, I will cover the pimples from where I need it. Also here, the redness. I really don't like that. I just see where it needs at that moment. Mm -hmm. I'm not very specific. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I like to cover all the redness. Can you show me what number is that concealer? It's 20. Mm, basically all the spots that I have I cover with the concealer. I love That's doing fine. it with my fingers because I feel like skin on skin is so much better. I use. I love that kind of brush. It gives them this kind it's of... fluffier. Yeah, it's fluffier so it's like it takes away the product that you don't need on the skin. Nice finishing. Love it. So it's just concealer. Nice. Well, then foundation. Oh, no. oh, do you it's usually use foundation every day or just no, occasionally? I don't. I don't. But sometimes because it's a bit darker, mm -hmm. I use it on my cheekbones, oh, okay. on my forehead, just to give that kind of sun kissed. Because this is so watery. It's like it doesn't have coverage basically. It's like it's really like water. So I will go a bit here, maybe. And it also gives a bit of like a glow. So if I put it all over the face, it's too glowy for me. Yeah. So it just gives me that kind of natural, lovely finish. Good. If I want to go for more like an evening, I would probably do the eyes or the lips and then a bit more on the T-zone because my skin is combination. So I need to really... Gonna kill the shine on the... Yeah, kill the shine, kill the shine. Fit mm -hmm. me, okay. poreless control powder. Con I still can see the bluish color underneath the eyes. And that's why I'm doing here is adding just a good amount of warmer tone concealer and I'm blending it out with a lighter concealer that she used earlier. Instead of mixing two colors together, I prefer to use two different colors separately because by then you can reach the like coverage this, right? that yeah. you want it. Okay. And now I go with my uh, lighter concealer. Oh, I need to blend that a bit. Yeah, blend. Oh, look at that. I will use the powder. brush actually uh, belonged to my grandmother who wow. passed away and she used to use this combo mm -hmm. and this is how I learned about it it was from her and it really brings out the blue color in my eyes so I would even go like just like that oh okay yeah just like not not too specifically on one area just like to so I just go and just like Put on my lid 
and my eyes instantly nice, look bluer. Nice. It gives you depth of the eyes yeah. instead of giving colors, right? Yeah, it's like it's it's bluer and then I go a bit I always try to go a bit on top because it to me it looks more natural. I think that when the sun shines, it shines on this part more rather Lining. than mm -hmm. here. I don't use it as a contour, I I use it to give myself tan. And then mid here just to have the general color and on top of here mm -hmm. because it's the most exposed to the sun small brush yeah the small brush and just go a bit underneath here I'm using the pencil. Yeah. Oh, it's very creamy. Is it? Mm -hmm. Wow. It's very nice. Mm. Or clean, Take a bit clean. like from the... <laughs> 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 yeah, debris. Good idea. Actually. I will make uh, my lips matte. Mm, with color. Yeah. Instead of with powder. Yeah. And this color, this is so beautiful. Yeah, you have to tell us like what color is that? I don't I don't know because the the thing got <laughs> it's gone. It's gone and I don't remember it myself, so I don't know. We'll just have to Whenever I need to replace it, you have, have to, to look match for it. it. Yeah. Wow. It feels like it was made for the lips. From the debris again. The debris again. <sighs> we don't want to waste the product. Yeah. See, I like to put it in the middle. I don't oh. know why. I feel like it's pretty when I put it in the middle. Sometimes I go a bit like. Here, if I want to look cute, just like to give me that kind of. Oh, I'm so shy. <laughs> okay. This doesn't hold it as well, but I mean, it looks for tidy. A while. Yeah, for a while it looks tidy, and then whatever happens happens. So I just try to. I don't like to overdo it. I don't like to make my eyebrows stand up too much because then you look surprised like always surprised like. all day okay take it ever so lightly so you don't do the upper lashes I don't do them never like I never, never do them oh. I feel like my face needs balance from the bottom so this would be just like my, my all day look let's do the papers Alana Center of the eyelid to make it balanced but subtle. Yeah. I can, as you can see, like this 
-hmm. This part, you said that it's not covered. Mm -hmm. So that's me. And last thing. Okay. Spray it. Okay, visualize now. Yeah, one, two, three. And also the hair. Mm -hmm. This magic water can do everything. Yeah. <laughs> I love this so much. Especially with the hair too. Mm. Especially if you like messy hair. Yeah. This whole hair stay messy. Yeah. <laughs> you look so pretty.